my fellow Americans. As I speak these words, America edges closer to a genuine crisis, real crisis. Donald Trump beat Hillary Clinton and became the president of the United States. The Trump haters put together a group of far left, Democrat, Trump-hating lawyers and FBI agents stuck Mueller at their head. They were supposed to convict Trump of working with Russians to steal the election from Hillary. That just didn't work. They didn't have it. There was no collusion, no cover-up, just a lot of politics. When Mueller's minions couldn't bust Trump for anything, the left-wing cuckoos went berserk. They are trying to get his tax records, his business records, his medical records, trying to subpoena his lawyers, his children, his dog. Well, maybe not the dog. They have gone completely nuts. Their sole mantra is impeach Trump. Impeach Trump for anything. Taxes, business dealings, collusion, collision. They're even trying to impeach him for leaving the White House toilet seat up. I remember the dark days of government excesses in the J. Edgar Hoover FBI, the Joe McCarthy House Un-American Activities Committee. As bad as that time was, today's craziness is far worse and far more dangerous. If these loony anti-Trumpers impeach Trump and try to drive him out of the White House, the reaction from America's pro-Trumpers will not be gentle. I truly hope, I desperately hope, that AOC, Pelosi, Schumer, and the others think long and hard before pushing America over the cliff.